So, I hope you guys liked episode one of Bad Girls Club All Star Battle season two. Um, it was it was pretty interesting to see what they did show. Um, Sixteen girls. The house was really really nice, and you know of course. It was good to see Ray J again since Miami when all the girls were fighting over his phone number. But yeah, let me see. First challenge, it was, well, as you can see, like for one, my dad was supposed to be watching this with me. Um, he's been asleep the whole time. I think he already played twice. I already ate dinner. His food's on the counter and he's still knocked out. He wakes up during one commercial and he's like, oh, there's a lot of commercials. I'm like, no, motherfucker, you've been sleeping this whole time. And he promised to do this video with me, which he is asleep. So since he was asleep during the show, he's asleep during this video. Um, he's doing the same shit. But I can say that he did get a job, and he's been there for a few weeks now. His, fortunately, his truck messed up, so I've been getting no sleep. I've been taking him to and from work. But yeah, anyway, so back to the show, um, getting into the house. It was really cool. It was like really surreal at first because it's like I've watched... Bagels Club in the past, and so um, I think he's waking up, and, okay, so <laughs> I watched it in the past, and it's really weird, because it's like, I already know these girls' personalities, just as you as viewers know, because I watched it before I was on the show, so actually coming into the house with them was completely surreal, it's kind of like you already know them or something, so that was kind of cool, um, yeah, so, all these distractions. Here comes Kiko. Hi, baby. Kiko, don't wake him up. Sit down. Sit. Sit. Okay, um, so coming into the house. First captain challenge. Um, it was extremely hard. He's chewing on my dad's pillow. Yeah, anyways. Captain challenge was really, really hard. The mud was, like, pretty deep. You had to <laughs> run, which is like running through water. Like, it's hard to even get through the mud for one. Secondly, I'm short. There weren't, what, 16 girls, 10 balls, I believe, or maybe it was less than that at first. But, like, I was down in the mud. Girls were tackling me. I think Nancy, at one point, her hand went across my eye and got mud in my eye. She apologized. She's being really cool, whatever. Um, oh, which brings me to the fact of the first night in the house like I did not catch the fact that Camila snuck off with Danny and Amy I didn't know that they were already forming an alliance and it's like you guys are gonna form an alliance before there's even teams like I mean maybe you think you're doing something strategic but you're just gonna get yourself in trouble so back to the mud um, yeah at one point Megan was on my back she even said like yeah Sarah I'm 170 pounds like I had all my weight on your back and I'm like hello I'm 125 why would you be just laying on my back in some mud like anyways um, I didn't make it to the second round unfortunately I was trying my hardest I was so out of breath and I finally just threw the ball to Tiana and Tiana made it to the second round but yes yeah, so I'm happy that you know, Camille and Rocky did get to pick teams because I ended up being on the team that I wanted. I couldn't have asked for a better team than the red team. I really don't have any connection with Elise so far. And, you know, Steph seems like a really cool person. I met Andrea once before. Um, let's see. I liked Rocky from her season. Me and Tiana recently made up, so it was nice to be on her team as well. And then who else do we have? Paula? I mean, I saw her from previous seasons. Dad, you're awake! Hi. Can you say hi? No. Dad, <laughs> say hi to the camera. No, no. Say hi to America. <laughs> you missed both episodes, or the whole episode. Yes, remember Bad Girls Club All-Star Battle? Episode 1 was coming on tonight. And you slept through that, you slept through dinner, and you slept through part of this video. Well, let me see how many minutes. Four minutes of this video. Okay, let me hurry up and speed this up. I need to quit my job. It ain't working out. Yeah, his job, <laughs> his job ain't working out because, can I'm you hurry tired. up and come back? Because he's tired nowadays. Um, so that was the ball thing and, you know, the teams, as I said, you know, it kind of sucked being picked last. I kept looking. I was like, oh, my God, I'm still here. I was looking at Janelle like, we're still here. I feel like the not cool kid in school who's not getting picked, which um, that never happened before, I don't think. I don't know. I used to not play sports. But, yeah, so it sucked being picked close to last, but 
I remember just standing there and I'm like, for one, I'm almost last. I kept looking at the gold team, or the red team, sorry. No, wait, I'm red team, they're gold team. So I kept looking at the gold team and I'm like, please don't be on a gold team. Please don't be on a gold team. And I'm like looking over there, like Alicia, Megan, and all those girls. And like, I haven't even had a conversation with any of them. Um, Valentina was really sweet, actually, when I met her in person the first night. Um, what else happened? Oh, so team challenge. It was so scary. We had to go... You saw the white vans, like bad girls vans. We went all the way in the middle of like nowhere it seemed like. And like we're already nervous because it's just like a nerve wracking feeling just knowing we're going into a challenge and that somebody is going home. But then as soon as we pull up we see these cranes and like we smelled the bay water. It smelled like fish like in the van. And like my stomach just started hurting so bad. We were all freaking out. Like we rode like red team rides together, gold team rides together. So I'm sure the gold team, I kept telling my team, the red team, I was like, well, if we're scared, we're nervous. Obviously they're going to be scared and nervous. And I can pretend not to be nervous. So I was extremely nervous walking up to the challenge and seeing the crane. But at the end of the day, when we finally got, you know, our helmets on and everything put together, like it was actually really fun. It was, um, I think that was a cool challenge. And it's definitely not anything close to being one of the hardest when you see what we do the rest of the season. But it was definitely fun. I remember when we were pushing back, I was like going through all these strategic ways. I was telling the girls like, put your feet sideways. No, do it this way. Do it that way. And like, you know, we were rotating and stuff. Um, not in order, but like how we were using our feet and everything. And I remember like when we started seeing more of the gold underneath our feet, because half of it was red, half of it was gold on the floor. We started seeing more of the gold, and that like just amped us up. We just started pushing harder and harder, and next thing you know, all the girls fell in the water. So it was a great feeling, especially for winning the first team challenge. You know, we went out that night. I bonded with Paula at the club. Um, I think you see me like booty shaking a little bit on the show. But yeah, so the whole girls for elimination, like I said, I didn't peep the whole alliance with Camila, Amy, and Danny at first. It all makes sense now watching it and seeing them talk and everything. Um, I'm glad Valentina saw it because Valentina was the one that pretty much told the other girls, hey, we need to break up their alliance and send them home. So the more alliances that are broken up, obviously it's the best for me. So I'm happy about that. But yeah, let me see. I think that's really it. We went over the first challenge, captain challenge. Um, Oh, so I saw the sneak preview to next week, as you guys did, and, you know, it's funny because I kept thinking that Megan was saying some stuff and being kind of shady every time I walked in my room. Like, I knew it. I even ran back. I told Shelly, I told Rocky, and I think Tana's like, no, you're being paranoid, and I was like, no, I mean, I just get a weird vibe. She's being quiet every time I walk in the room. She's changing the conversation. Like, I'm not stupid. If you're sitting here like... Da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, so dancing was really hard last week. Like, no, bitch. I know you're changing the conversation. Like, I know how to do that. You're not, like, fooling anybody. I know exactly what you're doing. So, for you to be in my room and you want to sit there and be all whatever and then, like, flick me off when I walk away. Like, it's whatever. I knew it from the beginning. Um, other girls from my team didn't believe me, so now they all see from the very first episode I was not being paranoid. But, yeah, um, I guess that's it. And Kiko, you know, last time I talked to you guys, Kiko was just finishing with chemo. That was, I think, that was a really long time ago. That was in July. So he's finished with that. He's still in remission. And um, now, like they said, his heart disease progressed. So he's on, like, heart medication for the rest of his life. He doesn't really like it. He cries a lot. But he's still so sweet and cute. I love my Kiko. Uh, so yeah, I know next episode is going to be really good. I already know what the challenges are going to be, so you guys have to watch. And if you haven't already, you need to go and buy my calendar. It's on sale for $20, and I will sign it for you. Um, you can buy it on saraholiver.bigcartel.com. This is how it looks. Here's the front. All the pictures are really, really sexy. Let me see. March is my birthday, so I'll show you how March looks. Isn't that hot? Look, and I got my pigtails in. <laughs> but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the first episode. And make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Sarah S.O. Oliver. And yeah, sorry my dad sucked tonight. Maybe he will watch it later. But I have to be up in a few hours because he has to be at work at 4.45 in the morning. So I will get no sleep. Mwah.